Okay, so the Sabres locked in the pick with like 28 seconds left. Okay. But that is a very good point brought up here in the chat. We've got 1,900 people watching, but that is a very, very true point. They have a lot of centers, the Sabres do. Cousins, Middlestad, Eichel, now Eric Stahl. Don't know if they would take a Rossi or a Perfetti. If they take themselves a sniper because they want goal scoring and they take Quinn ahead of Rossi, oh my goodness. Okay. Here we go. Kevin Adams, let's see what you got, man. What do you got? Oh, they're congratulating the Tampa Bay Lightning. Okay, okay. Lego looks like a future GMA. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, here we go. Rossi? Jack Quinn! Quinn! They took Jack Quinn over Marco Rossi. Okay. Okay. Quinn is six feet tall. He is 176 pounds. He had 52 goals in 62 games played. So Rossi is dropping. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. In my mock draft, I don't even know if it was my mock draft. It was like on Twitter or somewhere in a group chat. Oh, we didn't update the spreadsheet. But um, we were talking a whole bunch about how the... The Buffalo Sabres want goal scoring. And we were saying the entire time, if if Holtz is there, it's Holtz. But Quinn was there. And Quinn, whose middle name is not he Luke, by the way. Jack Quinn, very funny name, I'll say that. Second best goal scorer of the draft, in my opinion. But his teammate, Marco Rossi, led the OHL in points. No doubt in my mind, Rossi is dropping because he is 5'9". That's why. Sebastian Jara says it right here. Rossi is Caulfield. So, yeah. You know, it's a good pick for what it for what it's worth. Getting Jack Quinn alongside of Jack Eichel, alongside of Middlestad and Cousins, it's a very good piece added to your organization and it's long-term depth. It's just the question as to whether or not it's worth it going with this instead of some of the other players that were available on the board, like that Perfetti or like that Marco Rossi. But Jack Quinn, though, very, very good goal scorer. He's a two-way player as well. He's got a lot of really capable two-way um, ability out there on the ice. He was a very good Ottawa 67. And before anybody says, oh, he's only good because he played with Rossi, no, he didn't play with Rossi. They played on separate lines. So Jack Quinn is indeed a Buffalo Sabre. That is very interesting. We will see how that ends up going as the draft goes on. 2,029 beautiful people checking out the stream. I love having this over here. Thank you so much for your support. But talk to us guys in the chat here. What exactly is Quinn going to do with Buffalo? And what is gonna be the fate of that Perfetti or that Rossi? Let's talk a little bit about that stuff, guys. <laughs> 